Hello, welcome to Cyberpunk. So the game is exactly what you expected. A lot of bugs, a lot of problems, a lot of glitches. We also have the, you know, the pre-order stuff. The game is very hard to capture or to stream. You need to do it on display capture. If you do it on uh, a specific window or on a full screen application, it will not really work. Also, you have a lot of graphic settings and I don't really... I mean, this is basically a game for the newer generations of GPUs, which is weird because not a lot of people have them. But other than that, the film, grain and all of the other basic stuff. And some of the other stuff. Again, it's very hard to make the game work as intended. You just have to do so much on your own. I'll also play on very hard. I like how the graphic changes from a cigarette to a pistol to an assault rifle to the mantis blades. And also highly cyber cyber military. Okay, let's play on very hard. I'll also play as the nomad. Why? Because I like the way it sounds. And also you'll start driving straight away. If you play as a street kid, I guess you get into a fight pretty early in the game. And the score, well, more or less the same. By the way, this is hacking, this is shooting, and this is something in between. Now let's select the way we look, which is, I don't know, weird. <laughs> By the way, this is randomized, if you're wondering what this is. Your eyes usually have something different. Well, not go for that one, because that's weird. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. Yeah, okay. You are V. Well, sometimes you'll see people having other options. Sometimes it's a little different, depending on how you play. So, to be honest, there's not, not much customization over here. And if you press too quickly, you'll just go over the hairstyle without actually seeing it. You have to be patient until you choose your head. Your head is important. You'll wear it the whole game, right? Doesn't really matter. Okay, this is where you kind you kind of stop, and I don't like the stop. Beard. Unavailable beard. What do you mean? I can't have a beard. Cyberware. Okay, no cyberware. Oh, those look terrible. Tattoos, piercing teeth. Nipples, why would you have an option? Okay, let's make this anime style. Body tattoos, body scars, and that's it. It's, by the way, I have um, the filter, the profanity filter, whatever it's called, the nudity filter, and also the to the streamer filter. So <laughs> okay, can we go forward? Wait a minute, why do I have ear earrings? Is that a must? Okay, <laughs> where do I remove the earrings? No. This is the problem with games like this. They are so big, they really have to have everything, right? Well, I don't think I don't think they should have everything. Now I'm just oh piercings. Okay, that's enough for me. Next, next, I'm dying of old age over here. So we'll go with body because looks like on this hard difficulty you need to have more body, some reflexes, technical ability. To use tech weapons, you increase your armor by 5%, that looks nice. Also this is kind of like your defensive stat. And reflexes also gives you more mantis blades damage. Let's put more into technical ability because we'll be fighting a lot of people. And okay, that's enough. So that was already about five minutes. Okay, let's move on. 
Now, a lot of people are praising the game, a lot of people are complaining about the game. So, as a true fail, the truth is the game is a little overpriced for what it delivers. And by morning, a lot of people will have finished the game already, so it's it's well. Also, the game kind of needs you to play it more than once, but if you play it more than once, you'll not get 100% extra content. It will be probably about 50% extra content, believe me. It's not one of those games that is different if you play with another class. It's just a gimmick. You start off in the garage over here. We didn't have a vest before. We, oh. Electric coupling module. You said it was nothing serious when I came in. You said you were. Sh By the way, you can skip dialogue. You have to press C. Not space, not anything. This is on PC. You press C. Go to the database. But it will do that flickering stuff, which I don't really like. Ask a lone nomad why he's hugging the border. Yeah, step fine. aside. Step aside. What? Got any idea what? I am pretty sure of what I'm doing. So let's see our inventory. We have the revolver, which looks kind of nice. 52 DPS. That's a lot of DPS. Two attacks. Physical headshot multiplier, and also of course the slots for it. I think this is the DLC stuff. Six armor, six twelve. That's a pretty good armor, I feel. Armor is 20, stats are over here. Revolvers never go out of fashion. Wait a minute, where is my money? $300, okay. What I do? <clears throat> I'm gonna buy oh, tire. Sorry about this, but I'll just pass some of the Anyone stuff in the beginning so we can get to a little bit to the action. <laughs> what a beautiful car we have, right? It has even the bullet holes okay. to match the... It's like I was telling you. Not shabby Wait! Questions how long it'll last you. Yeah, did the car move or did he move? Figure something else out there. Ten on this heap don't seem like it packs a punch. Not liable to him much. You don't say. And I'm already falling asleep a little bit. You'll be actually be bombarded by dialogue in the first two hours of the game. Few hours past, I, I, I thought he'd at least called in. Don't you swear to mine. We're gonna hash it out. Yeah, he's a spitter, of course. Don't you owe the sheriff a word when you pay his town a visit? To tell him what's brought you here. Maybe even over a cup of coffee. My mistake. I hadn't planned on stopping. A failed coupling forced my hand. Yeah. Always some failure high mistakes. Name's Andrew Jones. Probably heard of me. I can't say that I have. Served in spec ops during the last war. Silver showguns. Ring any bells? I can't say that it does. Don't like to get along, do ya? That a nomad vehicle? Might have expected that. By the way, those are the posters you saw in a lot of... I don't know, a lot of pictures. Eh, not really too interested in that. There are a lot of things here and there, but I have no reason to linger. <sighs> no, nope, you sure shit don't. Nothing boils my blood like a fucking stray. Where'd your clan pitch camp? There is no clan. There is no camp. I'm here alone. Ain't buying it. No matter. <laughs> My family's in pieces. That's why I'm headed for Night City. Makes you an outcast among outcasts. Sure as hell hope you'll be on your way before long. I saw broadcast in comms tower on my way in. My antenna's down, and I need to radio someone. 
What you need's to hightail it out of here without another word. Ain't got no mind to see you drifting around these parts. Got it? I made it clear. I don't want any trouble. Then stop looking for me. Okay, let's get out of here. That was annoying. Now you're supposed to drive safely around the place, but nope. Let's go straight to the tower. By the way, this car is like driving a car from a Nintendo game. It drifts all over the place. Yeah, he needs a little convincing. Now also I need to see what is the... What is the key for quick save if we have any? Let's see. Cycle, fist. Fist is on four, wow. So what is the... Uh, okay, let's just go. <laughs> so the game kind of wants you to do these objectives, but it doesn't really mention how you should do them. So even though your main objective or main objective is to get to the tower, we'll do some extra stuff like looting and, you know, finding interesting stuff. By the way, this is FOV90, you should always kind of change it to 90 whenever you are playing, unless you want uh, to play with something else. Do not expose, yeah, right. Hello? Come in, come in. Ah, raised you finally. Willie McCoy. It's good to hear your voice. Fee. Wish I could say... I need your help. One last time. One last... I have to find the client with my payload, but I don't know where he is. Hmm. My card... Maybe the client left a message. Hmm. Sure. Jackie, what? Huh. Actually left a message. He's waiting on a farm. Clicking you the geolo. Thank. You do. Okay, now this is the weird part because no matter how you play the game, you're starting your, you know, your beginning, you always end up with Jackie on your head. Which is a little weird. Okay, let's find stuff to steal. And you're also moving very, very fast. If you're running, it's almost like you have a rocket. I don't know what that is. We can't pick it up. Yeah, super interesting. Actually, no, I was looking for the... For quick save, but I didn't see any quick save. Quick attack. Quick save. Well, we have a save. Okay. Now, let's see what other loot we'll find here because I want to get all the loot. So, we have kind of like a small advantage in cash at least. And of course, there will be other stuff that I missed, but I'm not so curious as to get everything. What is that sign over there that I can't pick up? I still don't get what that this icon is. Maybe it's nothing important, so that's why it's showing up like that. This is a bit dangerous, but hey, we'll do it anyway. Ah, 
Ah, well. Bubble gum. Three dollars for a pack of bubble gum. That's expensive. I guess those are playing cards and they're not worth anything. Okay, let's see that again. Maybe there's something over there as well. <laughs> it moves so fast. I don't know. It's hard to describe. The movement is not exactly controlled or... Uh, I don't know. It doesn't have any finesse to it. You just move around like a brick. Okay, that's enough. Let's just leave this area. I will try to find more loot the next place we get in. I at least want to get into the city. Now, it's very dangerous to drive through the little village because usually you end up killing people and that will... Sadly, the sheriff was right. <laughs> Let's get out of here as fast as possible. We almost killed them, someone. Well, someone really hit me for good. like a buggy, not like a real car. And you're not following me? No one is following me. Also, let's check out his car. Well, his car he looks worse than mine. Oh, we can break in if we have the right gear or the right stuff. Ah, some assorted junk. Don't worry, we'll have a proper tutorial in combat and some other stuff later on, but for now... We're just over here looking at stuff, browsing, as you call it. Oh, I was worried I'd have to turn to farming. <laughs> yeah, sure hope you're here for me. Euro dollars, what? Am I getting the items or just the amount of money? Shotgun ammo, I want that. I believe I am. Are you. Name's Jackie Wells. V. Seems you have cargo that needs to be moved. Oh, where I'm from, you share. Why don't we start with you then? NC native right here. Got Haywood in my blood. So 345. That doesn't mean much to me. So imagine a place where everyone's like your bro or sis. Or a <laughs> distant cousin at least. <laughs> I think I understand. That's Haywood. And you? I guess. You and me. The car. Hmm. Looks like we'll need a car. What fucking Nick? Okay. The car is too far away. Are you kidding me? Okay, okay. Let's let's play it by the rules. Last time I checked, I mean, last time I played until this point, which was not very long ago, it just. Oh. Later then. Okay, now we can talk to Jackie. I mean, if your car is too far away, we can't walk. And apparently now we can pick up every item that has that icon, which is weird, but hey. If it works, it works. Okay. Started thinking you might not come. They don't know what's inside, so yeah, it's just useless dialogue. We'll not skip anymore until when we reach the city. The sheriff. Yep. Yes, he was very angry at me too. Uh, what a fat ass. 
You are fat as look at you, 140 kilo, 140 kilos. Now, guys, do you trust in my driving skills? I don't. You have the manifest from the transport. Of course I do. But the fixer didn't give you the job deeds. He... He did. I was just making sure. Listen, friend. We're both professionals, ain't we? Hey. You, uh... Sure you've moved contraband before? Why, are you nervous? Me? Scan us and check our papers. <sighs> okay. I'll do the talking. Okay, we didn't kill anyone, we didn't drive over anyone. We are safe to go. Don't don't hit the search. Hand me the manifest. Don't need to see it. Grab these. Let me see. <laughs> it's marked LOA. Perfect. What's that mean? Lost on arrival. It means the cargo is flagged as to be lost as soon as across the border. Oh. So they know we're smuggling. They're about to find out. Oh, yes, they know. The owner of the vehicle in the inspection area will report for further questioning. What now? We want the customs officer to turn a blind eye to our dubious docus. We'll need a sweetener. Do you have the credit chip with the bribe? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Forgot about that. Right. You forgot. By the way, I hate Jack Ewells because he's the type of character that speaks in two languages at the same time. Pretends to be a tough guy, but he's not. He's a big guy, but he's not very sure of himself. Basically an NPC. Now, if you try to run away, they'll shoot you. See those turrets over there? Somewhere there are turrets. They'll shoot you. Oh, nice. You are the military guys. Oh, hello, little lady. Okay, let's go. Let's go. If you're armed, place your weapon here. Yes, you have a big revolver, which looks kind of cool. Now, please report to room number two. Watch it. Sorry. Did I spill your French fries? Hey, friend. You good? Room two. Please sit. Papers. I know the rules. Everything's there. It might be. It might not be. We'll see. Hmm. What are you transporting? It's all in there. What, everyone is ex-military over around here? There's one additional enclosure to the manifest. I think that's worth about one thousand dollars, to be honest. Ah, yes. Remind me, you drive for which nomad clan? None. No clan. Bold. You know, whenever I... The feelings... Go on now. Okay, so he took the bride, now we just have Don't to go to away. Nicola? Wait, 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 we have to see this, we have to see the commercials. It's at home, keep it safe. You might be a new hero. Just ads, look at that. No, 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 we'll not watch that one, we'll not watch that one. Whoa! 
<laughs> Sorry, I have to get my big gun. <laughs> Be careful with that toy. And welcome to Night City. Those little shits imagine Night City is some kind of paradise. What can you do? Young Now this is where I made the mistake the first time I was playing. You are supposed to go back to your car. Nice. If you if you follow that line, they'll shoot you. What happened in there? I'll tell you soon. We need to get out of here. Hey, I'm, yeah, I'm okay. driving. I was driving. I think it's better that he drives because I have a tendency to murder people. I, I try hard, but it's like playing Armageddon all over again. Don't give me the wheel. You gonna tell me what happened? Give me back me there. the backstory. The customs dickhead got nitpicky, and that ain't normal. Not to that extent. Smelling trouble around the bend? Drive, Jackie. Just drive. Uh, stay back. Oh, it's oh, it's nice. It's a smart it's wall. Away. This does not look good. Stop your vehicle immediately. Let's get out of here. On it. You are transporting contraband that is corporate property. I repeat, stop the car. You stop it. I'm dry. I'm. I mean, I'm co-piloting. Alt to draw weapon. By the way, as a small, small note, this game is very dangerous in one regard. It added aim assist to melee and uh, shooting in a PC game, so be very careful about this. You would want to de deactivate all types of assist. Well, I think I hit someone. Okay, I hit one bullet out of 20. Wow, this... Come on, this is... Well, that's better. Yeah, drive, drive. Ah, those pendejos are stubborn. I guess it doesn't really matter if you shoot them or not. It's a cutscene. Hey, watch it. Mierda, close call. We lost them. Hey, close. Not sure my nerves can handle this. Keep driving. Can't stop here. See his uh, big crybaby. I'm gonna stop here. Need to sort out a few things before we go on. Yes, kill some more people. Fucking hell. Yeah, actually, he'll stop. He will stop doing that. Come on, learn that single language. That what you call smuggling? Oh. Supposed to go smooth, no problems. Calm down. Sometimes these things happen. This? What kind of shit happens? Border security tipped off the corporation that we have their cargo. What's the deal with these borderlies flipping us the finger as they fucking please, with no consequences? He took a risk. He assumed we didn't have a clan backing us, and he was right. <sighs> So what now? I could ask the same question. Will you keep whining, or will we put a bow on this thing? No, no. I ain't gonna lie. We are. I'm, I'm looting. Lie. Can't pay you now. I have something for you once I collect my scrap for this corporal crap we're carrying. Huh? And you just figured I would sit by patiently. Actually, I wasn't gonna pay you at all. 
Just gonna bust ass and disappear soon as crossed over, but you're all right. I appreciate the honesty. Yeah, thanks. So, what's next? Now we take a peek inside. Oh, I unleash the beast. And no life. Uh, Half-Life Mass Effect? Open it. Oh, yeah. I hope oh, it's shit. a brain. It says Arasaka on the crate. We are robbing some heavy hitters. And maybe we'll make some heavy money. Is it a brain? It um, looks like a fish. A real iguana. A uh, lesser Antillian, I think. Does it bite? You think you can make some money on it? Sure. Think it'll make us happy. Us? Yeah, partner. We'll go half season. Any decent fixer will find a loaded gonk interested in a rare gem like this. It's kind of a shame, though. I always wanted a pet. Got the <laughs> name Manny all thought out. Hey, by the way, you uh, got any plans for what you'll be doing in Night City? Why do you ask? Because I got this feeling you got a lot of time and nothing to spend it on. And NC ain't a city that lets you get by without buddies. But don't you worry. Let me help you find Diggs. You gotta live somewhere. It's important to have people you can turn to. You know. Okay, let's go with him. Thank. Hey, come on. It's nothing. They got chemistry. Hey! Oh. Cuddly little fucker. Okay, partner. Time to grab the lizard and scurry out of here. Okay, don't bite us. I have to grab the lizard then. Okay, that was funny. Yeah, as you can see, you have a lot of options, but the game is so closed in the beginning. Like, you know, I don't expect open world all the way, but one hour of gameplay and you'll be bored. Oh. Ooh, I love this town. No, that's that's just kind of like a trailer. I hate it. They basically introduced another trailer in the game. <laughs> We're just here for the missions, not for the cutscenes, not for the silly, you know, silly gameplay. We're just here to see what the game is all about in the beginning. And after a while, maybe if it's good, we'll do more of it. chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Oh, Eyes and ears half a year her. later. Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Now and now we start the tutorial. VR. Okay, see you next time. Bye.